Hello and welcome to today's Where's the Trade? My name is Joshua Bellinger of OptionSizzle.com and today we're going to look at BB Stores Incorporated call activity. Before we get started though, I'd actually like to get your guys' feedback and you can do this by just putting what your thoughts are below this video wherever you're watching it at but I'm actually interested to see what name you think would be best for these nightly videos for the option activity. The name that I'm currently using is Where's the Trade but the other one I was thinking about today was Follow the Money or Following the Money so I'm interested to hear what you guys would think would be a better name uh, for the uh, series or just keeping it uh, what it is but getting into the content the activity that I picked up today was in the April 5 contracts and actually there was activity in this this uh, this name yesterday as well which has me a little intrigued but uh, today the April 5 contracts traded 700 times and you could see here the bid and ask was 0 by 5 uh, the block of 464 contracts were purchased today at 5 cents and if we roll down a little bit lower here we could see that there was some interest in the September 4 contracts where 85 traded and those were opening buyers at 40 cents there's a block of 83 that was purchased there so now taking a look at this and, and just some of my proprietary content here uh, I have a bullish sentiment on the activity the last few days where it's 92 percent bullish right now so it's uh, a little bit of a bullish bias and a little bit meaning that uh, the call activity is really putting it on a uh, a pretty extreme level but what we want to take a look at is the chart here so you know taking a look here prices have been pretty beat up and we can look at this on my other chart here on uh, the year time frame but you can see here that one time earlier in the year to the left here we're at eight dollars and fifty cents since then we've pulled all the way back to three dollars and fifty and uh, we've been forming this little bit of a shelf here and uh, forming this support level if we take a look at this on a longer term time frame uh, you could see that we're starting to form here and uh, we could see a little bit of a retracement into that five dollar level you know if prices do move higher so the positioning is a little interesting based off of this and this is just looking at the support level that we're holding so far here and looking at that you could see that we did dip below it a little bit but now we've been able to hold it and this would be where the 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 line in the sand would be one of the things that you could look to do um, following this action here is a little intriguing it's a little bit out of the money being that it has to move a dollar but there could be a catalyst that does that the other interesting play would be looking to do something with a uh, covered call but uh, looking at this you have let's say the four dollars so this approach would be just a covered call and you're just doing it at the money here you take in 25 cents if prices do go higher then you get called away the problem is, is that's 58 days but over in 58 days if this does get called away you could collect about six and a quarter percent if prices hold at four dollars or move higher and just taking a look at the chart here you know four dollar you the the level of support here is at three six 